Hi guys, welcome back to the news. This is Bliss Channel. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe to this channel and do not forget to give us a thumbs up. River State Crisis Sule Lamido reacts to Tinibu's peace accord with heavy accusation against the president. Former Jigawa State Governor and the People's Democratic Party, PDP shifting, Alaji Sule Lamido has accused President Bola Ahmed Tunubu of oppressing River State Governor Mr. Similaye Fubara to sign peace accord at the presidential villa on Monday. In a statement, Lamido said that what President Tinibu did in the so-called peace meeting is not brokering peace in River State, but using his office to enhance the fortunes of his political party. Lamido further claimed that the documents Governor Fubara of River State signed were under an environment not friendly to re-conflict solution, resolution and were presided over by the force of fear, intimidation, and blackmail. The PTP shifting Sule Lamido criticized Tinibu for diverting attention from primary presidential responsibilities to focus on protecting and promoting the All Progressive Congress, APC. He said there are many areas yearning for peace in the country where President Tinibu's political expertise, sagacity, and wisdom is needed. He said what skills has the president applied to stop the pains and the oppressions of the citizens of Nigeria, which everyone believes is the primary responsibility of the president, which he has conveniently looked away. Unwittingly, the so-called peace accord in rivers only planted the mines which will definitely explode in the not too distant future with collateral consequences on the entire country. He said Asari Tokubo and Chief Edwin Clark have alluded to this recent in recent times. Sule Lamido referenced a statement attributed to Chief Edwin Clark during a press conference stating that if Tinibu as the then governor of Lagos could stand up and fight President Obasanjo's awesome power and personality and enjoy to overcome can't PDP do likewise? In response to Clark's statement, Lamido suggested that the PDP must begin to combat this illegality through the country's justice system and exploit all other legal means available. The former Jigawa state governor, Sule 
Lamido further revealed, said that Governor Fubara may wish to know that President Tinubu, who shared the meeting, was running with the hare and hunting with the bond, therefore shared the document and toss it into trash can. He said the PDP executive should feel sufficiently embarrassed, if not slightly, if not slighted, by the action taken by President Tinibu to reward a political mercenaries with PDP fortunes in River State. More to the eternal shame of the PDP National Working Committee that a tribal voice of Ijor through Chief Edwin Clark press conference has to be deployed to challenge the illegality and unconstitutionality of the peace accord shared by President Hamed Bola Tinibu. Sule Lamido then said that if the national executive of the PDP does not have the nerve to stand up and protect its own, it should honorably step down to allow for the election of competent hands. So guys, how do you see to this matter? I can see oppression. And so guys, what is your take on this matter? Please kindly share your view and do not forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you. Oops.